We're going to discuss the importance of inclusivity, the path towards um, a world where every woman can work in the role that you know, they want to do with the right fitting, right PPE that fits well and that is fit for purpose. And I think the one main thing, um, and I'm sure you've all heard it before, is don't shrink it and pink it. Uh, women want to blend in, they want to have their own fit, they want to have their the fabrics that work for them, they want to have the features that work for them, they want to have the same amount of features. So offering a women's specific fit is you know, it's not only key to comfort but also just bottom line safety. Um, so nobody should have to wear a garment that restricts their movement, is at risk of snagging or even worse entrapment, just because it simply doesn't fit properly. So my question for you Ryan is, how can we encourage greater collaboration between manufacturers, employers and regulatory bodies to develop and promote inclusive and effective workwear solutions for women across different sectors? Things like this today, where we can have customers and suppliers collaborating, you know, RS is a fantastic vehicle to market. You know, we've got the, the customer insight, uh, support from manufacturers to, to develop the products and then a vehicle to market to such a large captive audience. I think that's the key to unlocking that potential in terms of collaboration um, based on true insight.